Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in this world. Welcome to Nourish My Soul. This is your online devotion from your L.A. Field Nest family. We are from uh, Los Angeles First Filipino Church of the Nazarene. Join our church every Sunday, 9 a.m. at Wiley Chapel, Los Angeles, California. Here's our fellowship schedule. We have Nourish My Soul in Facebook and YouTube, Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Wednesday, 7 p.m., Walk Through the Bible. It's a virtual midweek live, Facebook and YouTube. Friday, 8 p.m. to 9 p.m., a one-hour Bible study and prayer party. And on Sunday, 9 a.m., in person at Wiley Chapel or virtual worship live at Facebook and YouTube. Let's start with the reading of the word. Today is February 1. Wow, it's February already. Today is Monday, February 1, 2021. In Isaiah 64, verses 6 to 8, all of us have become like something unclean, and all our righteousness acts are like a polluted garment. All of us wither like a leaf, and our iniquities carry us away like the wind. No one calls on your name, striving to take hold of you, for you have hidden your face from us and made us melt because of our iniquity. Yet, Lord, you are our Father, we are the clay. And you are our potter. We all are the work of your hands. Philippians chapter 2, verses 7 to 8. Instead, he emptied himself by assuming the form of a servant, taking on the likeness of humanity. And when he had come as a man, he humbled himself by becoming obedient to the point of death even to death on a cross. Your name is valuable. Ever felt worthless? Ever felt like a cast off? Ever felt like an inexpensive piece of junk? Ever felt too banged up, too messed up, or too beat up to have any value? I know, I have. But there are two things I've learned from my obsessive love of big bikes and bagsak presyo markets that have convinced me of our value. First, the maker matters. For a bike, is it Harley Davidson? Is it Yamaha? Is it Honda or Suzuki or Kawasaki? Why is it like Harley Davidson? You know, there's so much value. It's so pricey because the maker matters. We have the best craftsman in the universe. We were made by God. Look at Isaiah 64, 6. We are all infected and impure with sin. When we display our righteous deeds, they are nothing but filthy rugs. We are banged up, messed up, and beat up. We may feel worthless, but we're valuable. Look at verse 8. And yet, O Lord, you are our Father. We are the clay, and you are the potter. We all are formed by your hand. Yes, we are all formed by God's hand. The maker of the universe crafted you. Be proud. The one who had the creative vision to form the mountains and the valleys, the rivers and the canyons, the oceans and the plains creatively formed you as well. He chose the color of your eyes, the pigment of your skin and the curl of your hair. Kahit na kulot ka, mahal ka ng Diyos. <laughs> or lack thereof. 
kahit na kalbo. Sabi nga, Arabo. Arabo. <laughs> His fingerprints are on you. His signature is on your soul. You have value because your maker matters. The, the second lesson I've learned is that value is determined by what someone is willing to pay. Kung may pangbayad, may value. That's why sa Harley Davidson, ang target nila yung mga middle-aged men, successful businessmen, because kahit na double the price of their counterpart na mga, mga Japanese bikes, these people will still buy because they are determined no? and they are willing to pay. Someone was willing to pay a great price for you. Alam mo ba yun? Someone was willing to pay the ultimate price for you. You are so valuable to Jesus that according to Philippians 2, He gave up His divine privileges. He took the humble position of a slave and was born as a human being. When He appeared in human form, He humbled Himself in obedience to God and died a criminal's death on a cross. Wow. He gave up his divine privileges as the son of God, humbled himself and died an excruciating death. You are so valuable that he was mocked, beaten, and nailed to a cross. You are so valuable that he, that he defeated the grave so you could be reconciled with the Father. That's the value you hold. Jesus has deemed you extremely valuable because he was willing to pay the price for you. You are not worthless. Your maker matters. Your value is determined by the great price Jesus was willing to pay because your name is valuable. You being you is valuable. Again, whatever your name is, your name is valuable. You are valuable to God. Let us pray. Lord God, thank you for putting a value on me. Lord God, I want to I wanna, uh, assume that value and I want to reconcile myself to you. Lord Jesus, I repent of my sins. I ask for your forgiveness. I am a sinner. But I believe that you died upon the cross for me that you shed your precious blood for the forgiveness of my sins. I accept you now as my Savior, my Lord, my God, my friend. Come into my heart and set me free from my sin. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name, amen and amen. Happy Monday. Allow me to bless you tonight. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you. And be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face toward you and give you peace. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen, and amen, and amen. God bless you. This is your Nourish My Soul online devotion. Thank you for having us, for listening to us, for watching. And uh, see you. See you tomorrow. God bless you. Bye.